Hey, welcome back to another week. Um, this is Charles Allwood again. Follow me on LinkedIn. I'm posting twice a week now. What I'm trying to do is, you know, document my mistakes in starting my own business so that if you're interested, you don't have to repeat the mistakes. Whereas other people are just kind of interested in this uh, crazy journey I'm taking. So it's been a lot of fun. I've run into a lot of walls, made a lot of mistakes, but it's also rewarding to get past those challenges and, um, you know, create my own adventure. So let's get right into it. The, the real thing I want to talk to you about today is um, Salesforce. So Salesforce, you know, as you see here, it's, you know, 19.5% of the, the CRM market. You got, you know, SAP, Oracle, uh, Microsoft, Adobe, Microsoft Dynamics, CRM. So the other interesting thing is Salesforce bought Tableau, right? So a big competitor to Power BI. The deal was $15.7 billion, um, huge amount of money. You know, Avi Singh has even asked me on, on several of his shows now, you know, what, what am I seeing in the market, you know, as I'm talking to clients and stuff. And ironically, even though they have Tableau, I'm seeing people take data out of Salesforce, dump it into... Excel and use Excel and then tie it into Power BI to do their reporting. So two, two of the main reasons um, I believe are, you know, number one, Power BI is free. You can go and download desktop, you know, Power BI, share the PBIX file, and that's all free. I'm also seeing there's companies like Cloud Extend, you know, that are creating live connections to Salesforce so that you can download into Excel. Um, and then once they get it into Excel, I'm seeing a lot of customers that, you know, want to port it over into Power BI. So here's a screenshot of Power BI. So one of the biggest issues is Salesforce ends at the sales process. And then I've heard three or four times now clients want to integrate their um, ERP, MRP, their profit margins, operations data. And, you know, the biggest complaint about Salesforce is it doesn't tie into all those different databases. So with Power BI, you can see how easy it is. These are all the connectors. You can have it on SQL Server, Oracle Database. You know, you can port, ex export data out of your ERP, MRP into Excel, connect that to the Salesforce data that you bring in. And this is how, you know, you can bring in Salesforce data directly, um, or you can port it into Excel and then connect to it then too. So tune in again next week um, and follow me on LinkedIn. Um, that's where I post all my latest content. And then also on YouTube, I post um, some of the older videos so that you can go back and watch the older videos. Thanks. Bye.